Demand for change to prevent guns from getting into the wrong hands. A Mid-South official says lack of training in officers could be to blame for some courthouse incidents, but the sheriff says he needs more funding to improve security. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres explains both now working together to fix the problem. June 19th, a Coffee County inmate attacked and grabbed a gun from a deputy and shot him and another officer before killing himself. A nightmare officials fear could happen again. I expressed some concerns about courthouse security issues and the need for additional help and resources. District Attorney Craig Northcott held nothing back at the last commissioner's meeting, saying not every courthouse officer is certified under the same state training. He brought up other incidents, including an officer getting suspended for leaving her gun in the bathroom for someone else to find. We need more post-certified officers. We need more courthouse security personnel that are assigned, uh, if not exclusively, primarily to courthouse security. Both of us agree that we need more. Uh, Sheriff Steve Graves uh, says although not all of his officers are state certified, they're still meeting minimum standards through courtroom security training. But he admits more should be done, which likely requires more funding. We, we don't know exactly what we need. Uh, I think that's why we contacted a, a specialist to come down and make recommendations. A state law enforcement training director will be assessing the system and offer any recommendations. That doesn't change the fact that we have a problem and, and we're both more than willing to work with each other to fix that problem. County officials say they will further discuss the issue as now the assessment continues. Reporting in Coffee County, I'm Matthew Torres, News Channel 5. Matthew, thanks. The sheriff says he'd like to get more officers. That means roughly $7,000 to train in the academy plus salary and the required additional training.